Hi, welcome to the review of the Running Start Agreement for Shadle Park High School. Running Start process. Hopefully by now you have attended or reviewed the presentation by our three participating colleges, SFCC, SCC, and Eastern Washington University. Please review the registration process and pay attention to the timelines and deadlines. We would like you to review this agreement, which can be found on the Shadle website. We will be going over the highlights of this. At the end, we ask that you and your guardian complete the signed form and bring it with you when you schedule a registration appointment with your grade level counselor. We will be doing registration for classes at Shadle High School in the upcoming month. It is important to note that you will be registered in, full, in a full schedule here at Shadle until the time that we know that you have been accepted by the college of your choice for the Running Start program. Please communicate this with your grade level counselor so that we can get an accurate idea of staffing for our classes here in building. Community college resources have some great things offered online. You can check these out. These are also on our website, as are the information for Eastern Washington University. Again, this is a personal decision that you make to either obtain an AA degree through the community college system or to start in on your college credits through Eastern Washington University. And now to the Shadle Park Running Start Participation Agreement. Important points. We want you to know that this is an exciting time, but this is a personal choice that you and your family make to take classes away from Shadle. You are responsible for staying informed of Shadle Park news, dates and deadlines and senior announcements. I cannot say this enough that you must access your student Spokane Public Schools email for all current updates. Information may also be found on the SPHS website. It's important to note that Running Start students are subject to all rules, regulations, and procedures governing college students for course requirements, content, registration grading, and appropriate behavior. The colleges will treat you as college students. Shadle Park High School and Parents Guardians of Running Start students will not have any information communicated to us regarding attendance or academic problems. Students will need to communicate directly with the College Running Start office uh, or their instructors with any college course concerns. Again, Running Start students are treated as college students. They are responsible for communicating with their professors and the college uh, offices that support Running Start students. Counselors here at Shadle are happy to offer guidance about your graduation requirements. If you have questions regarding your AA degree or the progression of your college classes, please refer to your college counselor. Placement exams are required and differ at each college. We, in order to receive college credit, you must place into a hundred level or above English course um, and also for math. We, if a student does not meet the minimum math placement requirement for the college, they will have to take the appropriate math or science class at SPHS. Students must have completed Algebra 2 with a B or above or score an appropriate placement score on the college math placement assessment to take a college math course. Running Start program will not pay tuition for any college course that is below the 100 level. Any classes that are taking, taken through either Shadle or Spokane Virtual Learning do count as credits and count with your 15 possible credits for the Running Start program. Your school schedule. SPHS is on a semester schedule and participating Running Start colleges are on a quarter schedule. 
starting, ending, and vacation dates will differ on each campus. If you are taking classes here at Shadle or through Spokane Virtual Learning and on the college campus, you will be responsible for knowing these scheduled times. We will expect you to be in attendance during our scheduled times here at Shadle, as will the Running Start program in the scheduled times for their calendars. It is sometimes difficult to coordinate daily when schedules uh, are at multiple campuses or programs. Students will not be allowed to leave class early at Shado in order to get to their Running Start classes. It is best to look at your schedule and leave transportation time in order to be able to be and participate at each campus. It is also important to note that we have a rotating schedule. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday are uh, have a certain time period. Tuesday and Thursday allow for advisory. Remember that we also have early release days on Friday. So again, you are responsible for knowing these schedules and planning appropriately to fit in your college classes. We strongly encourage you to commit to a total year of running start. Because our schedules are different, semester versus quarter, when, if you were to want to come back to Shado, it would mean that you would be coming back usually in the middle of a semester term. That often can be difficult and you may experience adverse effects to your credits, grades, and graduation eligibility. It is extremely important to do this, make these decisions in um, consultation with your grade level counselor. There is no guarantee that students in the Running Start program will be able to register for the desired classes for the specific quarter that they want them. Again, your chances for being able to get the schedule that you need go up highly if you maintain the uh, timeline that they suggest for your paperwork. If you have your registration paperwork completed on time, along with all directions that the Running Start program gives to you, you are able to register in a timely manner. If you miss one of these steps, then it becomes difficult to get the classes, professors, and schedule that you need. Maintaining all Running Start deadlines is the responsibility of the student. I cannot always make my schedule flexible to get you in to get your grad requirements discussed and planning over your high school requirements if you do not call in for an appointment in a timely manner. It is advised that Running Start students complete course graduation requirements by the winter quarter of their senior year. If Running Start students are enrolled in courses during the spring quarter of your senior year that are required for graduation, they will be allowed to participate excuse me, participate in Shadle Park High School graduation ceremony. However, Shadle Park will hold their diploma until the student completes the required classes and the college or university submits the student's transcripts back to Shadle. Grading and class selection. Remember that all rounding start grades are a part of your permanent high school and college transcript. The, not, the college will not send progress reports or warnings. Running Start students must maintain a 2.0 GPA. If students fall below this, the college will likely place a student on academic probation or academic warning, and the student will need to improve his or her academic performance during the next grading period. Running Start grades will not be weighted for transcripts. This impacts class rank for college applications, admissions, and scholarships. Spokane Public School District determines the college courses that count toward graduation requirements. Running Start students are subject to the same state and district graduation requirements as all other Shadle Park High School students 
including earning the required credits, meeting standard on all state assessments, and the high school and beyond plan. It is the student and parent guardian's responsibility with guidance from the high school counselor to ensure that high school graduation requirements are being met. Students will be required to meet with their high school counselor every quarter to check graduation progress and to complete a graduation requirement or enrollment verification form prior to registering at the college. It is the student's responsibility to ensure that the EVF is completed and returned to the Running Start office by the published deadline. Please make an appointment with your grade level counselor each quarter to complete the appropriate paperwork. This usually happens uh, about halfway into the quarter for the following registration quarter. Remember that every Running Start student registers for classes every quarter. So again, you must have this paperwork completed before you can complete your registration. Please call the Shadle Park Counseling Center Administrative Secretary to schedule an appointment with your grade level counselor at 354-6780. Again, all this information is posted on our Running Start website. If you are a student that is involved in athletics or activities. We, you are under the same requirements as any student in high school. The WIAA, the Washington Interscholastic Activities Association, has standards and uh, you must meet these in order to participate in these activities we highly encourage you to continue participation in all athletics and activities, but want to remind you that you are under the same requirements. So the form for this can be found on our website. You must meet the enrollment and GPA requirements as listed in the WIAA standards in order to be eligible for these activities and events. We highly encourage students to fill this out at the time of registration for the calendar year. If there are changes to the courses that you are taking or your credit load, it is important to remember that that might affect your activity uh, eligibility. Tuition and fees. College tuition is covered through the Running Start program. However, it is really important to remember that you also have other expenses through participating in college. Books, registration costs, lab fees, tech fees, parking and transportation are the responsibility of the individual students. If you qualify for free and reduced nutrition services at Shadle Park and have filled out the application, then you may be able to have the mandatory fees waived. It is your responsibility to get a copy of the qualifying letter for Sp from Spokane Public Schools Nutrition Services and submit that letter to your college for consideration of waiver of these fees. Students with a 504 accommodation plan are responsible for informing the college of their 504 status and providing all required support documentation to the Disability Services Office at the college. We wanna just remind you that this is really an exciting time for you and your family. Running Start is an excellent program. It is extremely important that you communicate often with your grade level counselor. Also, stay in communication with your college Running Start counselor. Both of these are two of your most important people to guide you through the Running Start process and your high school graduation requirements. Check your school emails frequent and often. Make a point of doing this one to two times a week. You will also receive emails from your college in your college email account. It will be extremely important that you are also checking these. Again, if you make this part of your weekly habits, things will be so much easier. Make all appointments within the suggested time periods. Don't procrastinate. 
it is difficult and impossible to schedule you for meetings or to sign paperwork last minute. We need you to be able to schedule these appointments with the Shadle Park grade level counselor through by calling our Counseling Center Administrative Secretary. Shadle Park wants you to be to continue to be an active participant of our school community. Please plan to stay in touch with friends, attend activities and sporting events, and to participate in athletics, music, drama, DECA, or extracurricular activities. You are eligible to participate in all these things, and we firmly believe that that enriches your high school experience. Lastly, we want to close with once a Highlander, always a Highlander. We are proud of you as you start this journey and will remain supportive of you along the way. Best of luck.